And welcome back in to WKYT News. Many people will, of course, be ringing in the new year, toasting 2016 at a party or gathering and be out and about, but it is very important to remember safety among all the fun. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Firefighter Jessica Bowman with the Lexington Fire Department is here with some advice. So you kind of summed it up for us when you came in. What was that? <laughs> uh, yeah, we still recommend that you don't drink and drive. Um, the best thing to do is to plan ahead and designate a driver in advance before you even start drinking. Okay. So, so you would say, I mean, go into this with a plan. Don't uh, decide it, you know, the party's over 12, 31, 2 o'clock in the morning that, uh, you know, now we're going to try to get home. Right. The best thing people can do to stay safe on New Year's is to plan ahead. So um, we know there's safety in numbers, so traveling with a group will help ensure that you and your loved ones uh, make it home safely. Um, also, we know your limits and stick to them. So um, it's never a good idea to drink on an empty stomach. So as a part of your New Year's Eve planning, include dinner and then rotate full glasses of water in between drinks to avoid becoming dehydrated or too intoxicated. It's in terms of what options are available for people with a designated driver, there's obviously Uber, there are taxi services. What else or, you know, are there certain ones that you recommend over others? Um, no, we don't recommend one over another. We would just recommend that you think about that ahead of time. So whether you intend to use a taxi service or Uber or have a designated driver, just have that planned out ahead of time. Or another option would just be to stay overnight at wherever you're going. Most people are going to be going to a bar or to a friend's house. So find a hotel within walking distance or ask a friend if you can crash on their couch. Um, both of those are a small price to pay as opposed to the cost associated with the DUI or an accident or something worse. What are those costs? How, how far can those reach? Um, I mean, every year we see, um, you know, cases of people who, who didn't make the choice to designate a driver and, um, you know, the, the costs are far reaching well, for yeah. them. Is and it thousands or? Oh, I, I would imagine so. And, and loss of reputation in others, but the fines, the, the, the right. hiring the, of the. The court legal, battles, yeah, the attorneys. The uh, very quickly before you go, the, uh, uh, a lot of folks, you know, might shoot off some firecrackers, make a little noise at midnight. What are the rules on that? Right. It's the same as at the 4th of July. So if it goes up or blows up, it's illegal in Fayette County. Easy to remember that way. <laughs> thank you. Thanks so much for coming in. Let's hope it is safe and a, and a quiet night uh, for you all. And uh, but thanks for being on duty. Thank you.